Today I'm going to show you how to make a gear tie for hanging up kind of bulky uh, hoses, stuff like water hose or airlines. Now if you're tying up extension cords, I actually have a video on how to wrap up extension cords where the extension cord itself will make its own hanging point. And if you want to check that out, you can see that one right here. So what I've got here is about three feet of cordage. And what we're going to do is we're going to be tying a fixed loop knot on the end, on each end of this rope in order to make our gear tie. Now the knot we're going to be forming is called the bowline and the method that we're using is called the snap bowline method. So we want to come down the rope, maybe about 10, 11 inches, something like that. We're going to form a small loop like so. Then you're going to take that loop and you're going to bend it over the standing line of your rope. Then you're going to pinch a small loop through your uh, from your standing end through that loop. Then you take the end of your rope, you're going to go through the loop that you just made and you're going to pinch it off on itself. And then all you have to do is just pull the whole thing apart and tighten it up and that forms the bowline. Now if you want you can trim off the excess after you get this tight uh, because this is kind of kind of be a stationary thing once we get done with it. So now all we got to do is do the exact same thing on the opposite end. We'll form our loop. Actually I didn't go quite far enough. We'll form our loop, roll it over the standing line, pinch a small loop through, take the end of our rope, send it through that loop, pinch it off, pull them apart, tighten everything up, and now we have formed a fixed loop knot on the end of each rope, and now we're ready to use it as a gear tie. Now, as I said earlier, if you want to trim off the excess, which I'm going to do on this one, you just come in here and trim off the excess rope. That way it kind of gets that tail end out of the end of the loop, makes it a little cleaner. And now let's go put it on the hose and show you how it works.